were floating, watching the orcas do their thing, and I saw this little head poke up out of the water. It was an otter. Dude, that otter is in trouble, man. Oh my gosh, he's coming right at us. Holy cow. Oh my gosh, he's coming right to the front of the boat. Oh, dude, the poor otter wants to get the heck out of the water. Oh my gosh. I yelled over to the other captain, where where did the, the otter go? She's like, it's on the back of your boat. I just breathed in orca breath. Hey, I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm not gonna hurt you, you're good. You can chill up here as long as you need. The otter kept jumping in. Again. Well, John has a little buddy. Orca's surrounding him. The energy coming off that orca was so strong. It was as though I was in the water with that orca. It felt like a knot in my stump. It's an energy I've never felt off of an orca before. As soon as it got up to the deck of my boat, she kind of plopped down and took a breather. You could see that the otter had been completely exhausted from game of cat and mouse with the orca and just needed a break. I gotta go and do my pickup. There's no way in heck I'm gonna try to get him off of my boat right now. Eventually, once we were a good ways away, the otter did a little hop off the boat and swam away to, to freedom.